What's up, guys? I hope you're real well. Chatio here. It's Friday, and yeah, my Christmas stuff is still up. Whatever. That's fine. <laughs> Today, we're checking out the two Ronnies, News Without News. If you're new here, hit the subscription button, ring that bell, leave a comment, give a thumbs up. Let's get into News Without News. Basically, it's basically modern day newscasts. So, let's see it. But let's me play it. Good evening. Here is the news. <laughs> it's a blank sheet. That's great. And now the rest of the news. Uh, it's still raining. And, uh, and the 8.33 from Watford arrived eight minutes late this morning. And there was a woman in an absurd pink hat on the train. And it was raining at the bus stop. At 149 Boddington Road, Harrow this morning, it was announced that unless something was done about the back boiler, there was going to be trouble. <laughs> Later, a man was understood to be helping his wife with the washing up. <laughs> oh, this is actually pretty good. I like this. That he's, uh, he's got an impromptu of the news. And uh, so he's basically just describing his day in a newsly kind of way. <laughs> my left hand is slightly larger than my right hand. <laughs> it was stated in London today. Ah, ah, here is a late news flash. Pull yourself together, man, and tell them something. <laughs> Uh, Auntie Clara and Uncle Bob are well <laughs> and send their love. They've had two fine days and Bimby and the twins are loving it and they'll close now, hoping to see you on Saturday. It's funny. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, oh, it, was, it was announced today that Edwin Klump has the best terms for light removal and odd jobs and he further stated that he would uh, go anywhere uh, and, uh, and in fact uh, do anything. Uh, we hope to have some film of that in our next bulletin. Uh, later today, uh, later today, Her Majesty the Queen uh, promised to pay the bearer on demand uh, the sum of one pound. Um, uh, um, the average contents of a box of matches is 36. And, uh, officer, inspecting food, what is this? Sergeant, it's bean soup, sir. Officer, I don't care what it's been, what is it now? <laughs> Joke number 76, copyright made in Sweden. <clears throat> HB, ever sharp. <laughs> Jenny, 246-8049. Easy. <laughs> Someone's phone number is scratched on the uh, on the on the on the desk. That's pretty good. <laughs> Robert Dougal loves Dusty Springfield, 1966. <laughs> Ingle Nook watchmakers. One two three four five dot seven eight nine ten eleven dot. And if any of you have got any news items that you'd like to hear, send them in to me, please. <laughs> care of the BBC. And please hurry. Oh, thanks. And now I've got the sack. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty funny. You know what? That's true. Uh, modern day media personalities is how they like to be called anymore. I'm a media personality. They can't do shit without their teleprompters. They, they have no idea what the hell is going on. They just sit there and read teleprompters. He was going to sit there and read the you know, the paper script of the news. But uh, I thought that was funny. That being said, I want to thank you all for watching. Stay safe, and don't forget to wash your hands. 